Well, I hope that you enjoyed my video the other day about cooking. Today, I'm gonna to be talking about something a little bit different, still gonna be involving cooking. I have worked for last two or three years with this guy named Tom Scott. He's got his own YouTube channel, uh, Fat Stacks with Tom. He talks about investing. He talks about the things that he's doing with his money all the time. And one of those things that I got to experience today was Tom losing $37,000 in the stock market. So let me tell this story. We're, we're, we're in the office. We've talked over the weekend about uh, this stock called GameStop. Um, you're probably familiar with them. They, they deal in uh, selling like Playstations, Xboxes, all that stuff, and then all of the games that go along with them. Well, recently there's been what's called a, a short squeeze, basically means that some investors or a hedge fund has come out and gone short on the stock, which means that they've bet that it's going to go lower. Um, long story short, the idea is that there's this group of people on Reddit called Wall Street Bets, and they got wind of this, and there's a difference between corporate America and hedge funds and them trading things and retail investors. I'll say myself, right? I'm in there as well. Um, taking control of your own finances, understanding really how to generate and grow wealth. I'm not talking about like generational wealth where you're making millions and millions and millions of dollars. Um, but for example, I made 10 grand in the last like two months in the stock market. Tom has nearly doubled all the money that he has. I think he's right around uh, $100,000 and earlier this year, he was somewhere around $38,000. We're talking from April to where we're at now. And so between saving and making money, I went from zero in April. So let's just say uh, May till now, I've got right around $40,000, okay? So that's, for some people, that's a year's salary. Um, but so that's why I kind of want to talk about some of this stuff too. Uh, so Tom bought a bunch of GameStop this morning. Um, the stock went from 90 to 144, which meant that he was up $47,000 on that investment that he made this morning. And before he could do anything, before he could sell anything, we were trying to have a meeting he was back down uh, $37,000, so he, he was up $10,000 for the day. But just a fun thing to talk about. Um, if you haven't looked up anything about it, GameStop, go on to Reddit, look up Wall Street Bets. These guys, you know, they're talking about different things. Some people are up $2 million, some people are up a little bit, some people are up a lot. Uh, just something that's interesting to maybe, to maybe think about. But definitely, if you have not, if you have not, think about Number one, what your future looks like. Uh, think about your finances on a daily basis. Uh, in our household, we have almost no debt. The only debt that we service is the debt on our house. And we owe probably 40% on the total note, which we bought it for. Right now, it's valued for almost, um, it's close to 300. So we're almost, you know, we probably got about, 30% of that remaining to, to pay off. No, less than that. 25%. But the, the whole point is this. If you don't have any debt, you can do whatever you want with your money. Um, so for me, it's playing around in the stock market. If you understand, if you are financially literate about what's going on in the stock market, you can make money without ever leaving your house. For example, think about my friend Tom. Tom makes $40,000 a year base salary. Today, he was up $47,000 and he closed the day up $10,000. So far this year, he's made approximately $70,000 in the stock market. He didn't start with a million dollars, he started with 30. And before that, he started by putting $300 in the stock market every single month. Tom and I gave uh, one of my coworkers $1,000. I gave 500, Tom gave $500. And our goal is to help him become financially literate. We're learning as we go along with him. Uh, and this is going to be an opportunity for him to make money. We, he was up $138 on $1,000 today. So the goal is to be able to turn that over and over and over again so that we can, I'm hoping, to, I'm hoping maybe we, if I'm super hopeful, we can double his money in, in two months.
two months. So stay with me. We'll talk about that. Uh, his name is Jacob. We're really excited about him. He's got uh, he's a young guy, just got married. And so this would be a great way to start out life, to understand uh, what you can and can't do and take control of your own destiny. So a little different than what I normally talk about, but guys, it's super important to figure those things out. As important as Adam Ragusea and diversity. Uh, thank you guys. Keep watching. Have a great night.